Hello everyone and welcome to this short hints and tips video. We are going to have a brief look to the X-Video codec in MovieZoo. You can find more details on this video description. MovieZoo allows you to create uh, amazing scenes, either be in the sky with jet planes, either be in the kitchen with a crazy cook, or in space with a dancing astronaut. You can even visit ancient Rome and see the gladiators. But uh, let's say you're not completely satisfied with your final video output, and by this I'm saying the quality of the video or even the file size it generated. That's where the codecs come in. So let's say that we have here a short animation. Uh, let's make the character walk a little bit and stop right there. So let's go and have a look to the codex here on the video and make video menu. As you can see you have a preview of the scene you want to create and you can click in options. Here you'll see the XVID uh, MPEG4 codec, that's what we're going to uh, talk about today and you can click on configure codec. Here as you can see um, you have um, the profile level and down here you have the maximum quality, it was set to maximum quality, it's what I usually use but you can also turn it down and create the smallest file, just be careful because the quality of the video will be inferior um, so you have to feel free to play with the settings uh, just make sure you write down what the uh, default settings are so you can actually go back if you don't like the results lots of options, um, feel free, like I said, feel free to to try them all, it's a bit of trial and error but I usually try and uh, get the maximum quality possible if it is a short scene, if it is a big video you might want to turn that down a little bit and then after that you just click OK and make video and you choose the, the name of your video and then click save, I'm not going to do that just because of uh, time restraints uh, and that's it, you can find more details on the video description um, I'm going to make a special note for the users of the 64-bit so keep an eye on it and uh, thank you very much for joining me and don't forget to have fun with MovieZoo bye bye